This video shows how to make a custom abutment from a preformed blank and opaque white metal with a screw retained restoration made from a self supporting ceramic such as zirconia or disilicate. An angled ball tip screwdriver is utilized for fixation screw placement. After the implant is adequately integrated, remove the healing abutment. Insert the impression transfer. It is important that the mating area of the impression transfer fully engages the mating area of the implant. Tighten the fixation screw only with finger pressure. Fill the top of the screw head with wax to prevent impression material from flowing into the head of the screw. Inject medium body impression material around the impression transfer and into an impression tray then take an impression. After the impression material has hardened, remove the impression. Remove the impression transfer from the mouth. Reinsert the healing abutment. Attach the impression transfer to an analog. Orient the impression transfer analog assembly so that the flat surfaces of the transfer match the flat surfaces in the impression and then fully insert into the impression. Inject thin soft tissue model material around the analog. Pour model stone in the impression and a model is made. Remove impression transfer from stone model. Design the abutment in a CAD software. Use a custom abutment blank to mill the final abutment. Place the abutment into the stone model to verify the fit. A slot is made to give the angled driver access. Insert the fixation screw with an angled screwdriver. Place the crown into the stone model to verify fit. Remove the crown and abutment and place the abutment onto an analog. If desired, white metal, a white resin material can be applied to the abutment. Sand blast the crown retaining surface of the abutment. Apply two layers of primer agent to the abutment. Air dry the primer agent. The surface will not be completely dry and will stay slightly sticky. Apply a thin layer of white metal opaque to the abutment. Apply white metal opaque only on areas that will be covered by the crown. Light cure the white metal opaque. Place a wood end of a cotton tip applicator into the screw channel to keep it protected. Apply bonding material to the crown. Remove the wood stick and bond the crown to the abutment. Remove the excess bonding material from the screw access hole in the crown margin. Remove the restoration from the analog. Place the restoration in the mouth. Tighten the fixation screw with an angled driver. The screw should be torqued to 30 Newton centimeters.